And now for walking the bass. So the bass note and melody of a chord progression has so much weight and importance to it. So here we're going to focus on how to create a line or melody moving between different chords. So um, let's check out this next example, which kind of does this uh, back and forth from uh, different strings where the bass note kind of has this jumping around effect. Check it out. One, two, three, four. Alright, you could hear there that we were clearly walking up, approaching that C chord, alright, with that. Alright, so let's try to do the same thing, but now going from a G chord to a D chord. Here we go. One, two, three, four. And finally, let's check out how a D chord would walk back down to a G. Here we go. One, two, three, four. And now for an old traditional Appalachian tune called Free Little Bird. And this one uses a whole bunch of different walking bass lines to go between the progressions. And I think this will take uh, really good use of the exercises that we did earlier so that you can play this in a full musical example. Check it out. One, two, three, four. <laughs> 